हेलो दोस्तों सभी को मेरा राम राम वेलकम टू आवर चैनल इंडियन साइबर टैक सीखेंगे दो साइटों के बीच में वीपीएन टनल मेरे पास वन साइड है फोर्टी गेट फायर वॉल एंड अदर एंड इज टी पिलिंग ई आर सी जीरो फाइव वी पी एन राउटर सो लेट्स स्टार्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी हैव कॉन्फिगर फोर्टी गेट एंड सो आई स्टार्ट आई पी सी विजार्ड you can see i have selected the name and here i have selected the site to site vpn there is two options for ticket and cisco i have selected the for ticket if you want to custom from here now you can select the custom but i just go to for ticket now i am inserting the branch site ip address static ip address i have and i have configure the pre shared key just click next here i have selected the local area interface so i have selected here i have multiple interface so i have selected two you can see there is automatically pick up the ip address of the interface now i am just configuring the remote site at branch site local ip address with complete series slash 24 in slash 24 we have 2 254 subnet we can connect 254 host so i have click the next and now click the create now i'll just now you can see the vpn has been set up but it is not connected now so i go to tunnel here you can see there is a multiple i just selected the recently created edit now i have selected over here convert to custom tunnel because other end is we have a tp link router so we need to create the custom tunnel So I selected it. Now you can select. Now you can see the configuration which we have configured earlier. Now I have just select the phase one and uh, customize according to according to our NTP counter. So I have just configured it. You need to just note down. all these things because you have to also configure these settings in your branch side router also so i have just note down all these things phase one encryption i have selected aes 128 and authentication as a chip 256 i have selected the group 5 and key lifetime 86400 it is mandatory it will be the same on both end so now i go to phase 2 and again i have just done the same things encryption authentication it's phase 2 i just note down the encryption authentication group and key lifetime i have selected all here as 120 is for the encryption and sh1 for the authentication and key life second is 43200 and group is Five. So please note down properly. If you have mismatch, so it will never connect. So please note down. Phase one, phase two, and password key. It will be the same. So over 
so at the end of 40 gate we have convert in the custom tunnel it's done so now we have go to the other end so let's go to branch and side router to configure according these settings So let's start. Now we have opened the TP Link VPN router. Now you can see over there the local area network IP address. So we have go to VPN, click on IPsec. Now you can see there is no tunnel, so I have to add, type the name according to you. So I have selected head office, it's land to land or client to land. You can also configure client to land, any host to site. So I configure land to land and branch to branch. One is our HO and second one is branch. So van port is like the van. Please make sure you have to remote gateway IP address for the firewall, which we have configured earlier. So there we have a static IP, so we have configured it. Local subnet, remote subnet. So we have, we have selected two subnet over there. So I have configured here is one. Second we will uh, configure later so pre shared key it's mandatory so now we have come for the phase one setting which we have configured in 48 firewall you can see we have mentioned all these settings over there so we have to configure these same settings over there please make sure the same settings over there there are three settings is mandatory to same phase one phase two pre shared key and also the network network part for the local LAN or WAN so we have configured it SHA ES DH5 Now we have select the key life seconds. We have configured 86400. So we have just copy and paste over there. Now we come over the phase 2. Now we have selected phase 2. A is one twenty eight authentication as a chevron group five. So we have selected now selected group five key life seconds. That's four three two double zero. So we have configured over there 43200. Just please make sure all these settings are same. Just click OK. Now oh, there is policy name, it's need to click uh, underscore or hyphen because there is not it in the gap. Oh, it's not again the hyphen, so we have just underscore. Yeah, now you can see we have configured the 
VPN tunnel and the status is enabled. So let's check the other end of 40 gate side, it's connected or not. Now you can see over there the VPN tunnel is up and it's connected working perfectly. Now I'll show you in the monitor side. VPN tunnel, it's named the database, it's up. Now you can also ping and access the site system. Thank you.